Maccabeam Revi, 4 Maccabees, 12. When he too had undergone blessed, rather blessed martyrdom and died in the cauldron into which he had been thrown, the seventh, the youngest of all, came forward, whom the tyrant, pitying, though he had been dreadfully reproached by his brethren, seeing him already encompassed with chains, had him brought nearer and endeavored to counsel him, saying, You see the end of the madness of your brethren, for they have died to torture through disobedience, and you, if disobedient, having been miserably tormented, will yourself perish prematurely. But if you obey, you shall be my friend and have a charge over the affairs of the kingdom. And having thus exhorted him, he sent for the mother of the boy, that by condoling with her for the loss of so many sons, he might incline her, through the hope of safety, to render the survivor obedient. And he, after his mother had urged him on in the Ivrit tongue, as we shall soon relate, said, Release me that I may speak to the king and all his friends. And they, rejoicing exceedingly, rather exceedingly at the promise of the youth, quickly let him go. And he, running up to the pans, said, Impious, rather, impious tyrant and most blasphemous man, were you not ashamed, having received prosperity and a kingdom from Elohim, to slay his servants and to rack the doers of his holiness? Wherefore the divine vengeance is reserving you for eternal fire and torments, which shall cling to you for all time. Were you not ashamed, man as you are, yet most savage, to cut out the tongues of men of like feeling and origin, and having thus abused, to torture them? But they, bravely dying, fulfilled their belief towards Elohim. But you shall groan according to your deserts, rather deserts, for having slain without cause the champions of virtue. Wherefore he continued, I myself, being about to die, will not forsake my brethren, and I call upon the Elohim of my fathers to be merciful to my race. But you, both living and dead, he will punish. Thus having prayed, he hurled himself into the pans, and so expired.